Hi, Children's Liturgy friends. Thanks for joining me today. Let's start our liturgy with an Our Father. So hands together. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit, amen. Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done, on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses, as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. Amen. Hands folded and in your lap. So I left you a video link today of the gospel. And it's really just a lot of words. And some of you may understand those words. But the first time I listened to this particular gospel, I was a little bit confused. So I thought I'd spend some time just kind of explaining it to you a little bit. It begins by Jesus saying and talking about a blind person leading a blind person. Think about that for a second. If you had to go somewhere, would you want someone who can't see to guide you? Do you think that that would be safe? You know what? It could be if that blind person had been there many, many times before and was very familiar with the place and knew how to get around. But a lot of us wouldn't think that it was safe because we think that just because they can't see that they don't know. Now, thinking about and jumping to conclusions about other people is not always a good thing because you know what? People can do that to us too and it makes us feel sad. The other important thing in today's gospel is not just about us thinking things of other people, but realizing that we are not perfect. I know I've made mistakes. I know I've said things that I shouldn't have said to people because maybe I'm frustrated inside or I was sad inside. And today's gospel asks us to look inside ourselves. So to think about what we do or what we say or how we think and thinking about ways that maybe we can make ourselves better people, more like Jesus. So that's my challenge for you today. I don't have a link to pictures for you today because I really want you to spend some time, especially as we get ready for Lent starting next week and thinking about Jesus in the desert and thinking about getting ready for Easter Today's gospel really kind of begins that process by asking us to think about ourselves. So think about maybe yourself and do you get angry when you shouldn't get angry? Do you take out your anger and your frustration on others? Do you not believe others quickly when they are telling you the truth? Do you trust people? Do you do good things for people all the time? even when they don't do something great back for you. Today's gospel is asking us to look in on ourselves and to realize that although every single person on this earth was made by God and is good, sometimes we forget that inside. We forget to be good because we have choices on earth. God gave us the choice between good and evil. And sometimes all of us choose evil by mistake. So today, Spend a little time. When does evil sneak into your life? And then think about ways to make yourself a better person. And then think about other people that maybe you've been frustrated with. Maybe they were sad or frustrated inside. Be more understanding. It's a really big job at that this week. Making sure that we realize we're not perfect and that we accept it because we're not perfect. Other people are not perfect and we shouldn't look down on them for that. We're all the same. That's your job this week. Good luck. It's a hard job. Let's end our liturgy today with the Hail Mary and the glory be. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, 
now and at the hour of our death. Amen. Glory be to the Father, and to the Son, and to the Holy Spirit, as it was in the beginning, is now, and ever shall be, world without end. Amen. In the name of the Father, and the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. So one last remembering, make sure you think about how you can be a better person, and also remember that even when other people make mistakes, that they're good inside, and that there might be a reason that they made those mistakes. Can we help them? <laughs>